back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Fig Challenge. This is Generation 6, which is based off Adventure Novels, Part 19. Uh, and we are going to be aging up Caspian. Never mind. Not using a cake. We're not. Never mind. Okay. Um, can you. Oh, he has to be technically holding him first. Okay, why don't you go dinner? Okay, go put it down. Caspian here. Zara's over there teaching Raleigh how to walk, and I did give Raleigh a makeover. Oh, and the baby just woke up. He's gonna start screaming. She's not in a good mood. Okay, we'll trigger his age transition. I need you to record. We have so many life fruits in our inventory, and I keep looking at them and thinking they're pears. Okay, Caspian excitable, loves the outdoors. I think I'm gonna give him loves to swim. I just feel like that's fitting. Wash la la! Okay, let's go take care of- yeah, look at- She's in a really bad mood. Uh, snuggle, give her a bath, play with, give bottle, snuggle again. Okay. He's off. We also need a car for the kids to be driving. Um, I mean, I guess I don't need to. Do we? We still have a scooter, don't we? We had a scooter. I don't know if we still have a scooter. Okay, so I might just kind of leave Salem's room. No, I should. I really should move it because Raleigh ages up. I have Raleigh ages up Tuesday. That doesn't sound right. Did Raleigh eight? No, Raleigh aged up Tuesday. That needs to be changed. Okay, so they are toddlers for five days. So, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, sun she ages up Sunday. And Salem ages up Monday into a young adult. <laughs> so, they will very, like, they'll be, like, in the same room for, like, all of a couple days. So, I'm just gonna leave it for now. We'll worry about it later. Okay, this is going to be Caspian's room, though. I'm sure you're not surprised that we're gonna go for like a kind of an ocean theme. We're gonna use the pirate bed because we we, we have to. How can you not? Um. Okay. Um. Side table. I don't really know what Caspian is going to like be into though. Like other than liking to swim. Like I don't really know. I don't know what to have as like things for him to do. Um, are there any other koalas, penguins? What? No, I don't want any of that. There's a little turtle. Maybe we'll use this one. I don't even know what this goes with. To be completely honest with you, not a clue. Okay. Well, but I also want him to have a desk. I like when they have desks in their own room where they can do their homework. Um, I mean, I could get the desk that matches the furniture, but I feel like that's really boring. <laughs> I also really wish this door was not here. I would much rather have it here, because then it would give me this wall, but then I don't have anywhere to put- I don't have enough slots to put everything, so. Oh well. So I would really like to have this wall for- his um his dresser I don't think it's gonna work should I put the desk here see but I don't like that it's not rounded like everything else here is like has a, like, a rounded edge like it all has so I want something rounded but I don't really have a lot of options for rounded like there's this one and I feel like that's too fancy if you ever wonder why like maybe I make some of the build choices I do, I can tell you most likely it's because I'm trying to match if like it's rounded edges or not in the other furniture. Oh, I see 
And look at that. Mm. <laughs> Doesn't match. Okay. We'll have to, I guess we'll just have to deal with it. Probably have just like a cute little desk chair, like a fun little rolly chair. Or should I just give him, should I give him one of the single tile? Something like that. I can not round it edges. <laughs> but it's supposed to go together. It's all from generations. So should we do that instead? Ugh. I don't know. Because I still have all this space. And I can't. Because I want I like the look of the bookcase. So I don't want to, I don't want or the cubbies. So I don't want to get rid of the cubbies. Because if I get rid of the cubbies to move this down. Dilemma, dilemma, dilemmas. And I just, like, I felt like with Salem's room, I had a direction I knew I wanted to take it. I have absolutely no idea what I want to do with Caspian's space at all. Um, maybe he, like, likes to read about, like, you know, pirates far away or something. Ooh. That looks like something that would come with World Adventures. I have no idea. Those are like full on in the wall. That's okay. Um, dun 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 dun. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not okay. He's also just a child, so like, will he really be reading? Probably not. Can they sit sideways on the bed? I don't think they can. Like, like the Sims 4, how they can sit on the bed and then like watch a TV. I don't think they can do that in here. Cause I was thinking, well, maybe I give them like one of the little box TVs, like one of these, but he doesn't have anywhere to sit. <laughs> Should we give him a little, little stereo maybe? Um, Cause I like the idea of maybe him having like a little video gaming set, but I don't think that will work. What else? What else? What else? What else? The room is just so boring. It holds no character like Salem's. What's that? There, maybe? I want him to have some kind of toy. Maybe we'll get rid of one of these. We'll put that there. And then maybe. Maybe like the treasure chest. Blech. I don't like it. It's just, it's the <laughs> It's just so boring. Oh, maybe we could do. That. Um, no. Hmm. What if he was into cars? Just seeing like, he's into like old cars. Maybe that could be fun. I don't know. That's what I just put up. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Are there any other? <laughs> There's fish. <laughs> you want some fish in your room? There you go. Fish, there's a pirate ship. Um, yes, yes. I know you can hear my phone going off. <laughs> um, I, think, I feel like that's really about it. I can't <laughs> Not my fave. Not my fave. Let's see what we can find in here, maybe. I mean, it's got pirate like skulls. Um, yeah, we'll go with the pirate skulls. Let's do that one. And then let's do. We could do maybe like a. Maybe a bit of a softer green. And then maybe that. Okay. Let's take this color. I'm going to put it on all the wood. I'm going to make it darker. 
charging it. I'm thinking maybe maybe green walls. There you go. Okay, so I need this color. Okay. Lighten it. I'm just steal that one. Okay. And then Should I recolor the pirate ship? I kind of want to. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that works. Um. And then. Use that. And that's like not the light I want in there. Let's see. I want this light. That. Ooh, maybe I can give him. I always like to give the kids lava lamps. I give them lava lamps all the time. I already spent like five grand on this room. Okay. <laughs> Needs little pins. There you go. Okay, back to the bathrooms. And his is gonna be set up exactly like Salem's. Possibly unflush toilet, it looks like. Um, God, $20, 20 for a roll of toilet paper? Gosh, inflation sucks. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. 65 smoothies for a thing of soap. <laughs> it's like, that's the kind of stuff I don't really pay much attention to when I'm building, but like, it's ridiculous when you're actually playing the game. What was, I was gonna do something else. A mirror, I was gonna give him a mirror. He doesn't have one out in his room. Should I do that one? Should I do, I'm just that one. So I don't think he would have, he wouldn't care about a fancy mirror. Okay, Caspian's room is complete. Oh, I should have. I should give him a rug. Hold on, let me give him a rug. Maybe that'll help kind of tie in the space. Um, actually, let's just steal this one because I'm just gonna keep it. Oh, I didn't recolor his chair. Oh nope. Which one am I? Oh, I am. Okay, I'm recoloring the right one. I thought I was actually recoloring Salem's for a second. It's like it's not doing anything. That would be why I wasn't being patient enough. There you go. Okay, now I'm done. Now I'm done. There you go. Yippee. All right, Caspian, go ahead and go to bed. All the lights, all the lights. Salem's bathroom, go to bed. Six to seven. He should go. To oh no, there is no school tomorrow because it's gonna be another. Freaking holiday! Have a long duck. How's it going? Taxi we are swiveling. So, oh, where did where was this one? Barbudi. This one would have been perfect for his room. I hope he looked right over it. Oh, it's okay. Just like seeing it storming in the game, it's supposed to be storming here. And then I have a really bad, and Moose is not going to be a happy camper. He's going to be pretty upset. Who has the. You have the Vespa. Okay. I'll move the bike over here. The Vespa here, and I'll just have that, I guess, is their way, is like the teen's way of getting around right now. I still want them to be able to, like, I still want to teach them to drive. Well, Salem specifically at the moment, but. I also need to rename this before I forget. This is Caspian's child, nope, child today. And then put it in here. You're not having
having any more children. Stop. <laughs> You're not. Potty train Raleigh really quick. Just so I hate getting rid of that wish though. I hate getting rid of that wish. It's like I love it when my Sims have like have family. I don't know. <sighs> no more kids. You were only supposed to have three anyways. And I was like, well, I'll just have one more. Because I wanted like each of the I wanted there to be three kids for each of the locations. Rather than like our oh. heir being named after a location when like that's like she's not going to be named after a location because she's the heir. Oh, she wants to woohoo. Don't have like the, the ability to do that right now. Or though I guess oh, we do have the ability, I just don't have the room for the wish. No, honey, she's already eaten. She doesn't need any more food. No already ate. Okay. Gort. Okay, so I figured to kind of wrap up this video, we were going to go ahead and take Caspian into Create a Sim, uh, give him his makeover. I also just made. Um, why are your eyebrows so dark? <laughs> what is he like? Blue? Yeah, blue. Um, I went into cast and I made a sim for Salem that we're gonna, it's currently spooky day, so we're gonna have a feast party. I figured we could invite him over and we could get to know each other. And why can't I just like, what would a, how would a sailor wear their hair? Um, let's have your eyebrows match. There you go. His eyes are so blue. Well, then I was looking at Raleigh, and Raleigh's eyes are like such a like a pay, like a very light bright blue. Unless oh, it's your outerwear. Okay. Um. Honestly, I don't really. I'm I'm okay with it. We'll just change the, we'll change the gloves to be blue. Maybe we'll make the shirt. Maybe we'll make it like a. Heather Gray. Um, this would bug me so much though, having sleeves that are that much like shorter than like whatever I'm wearing underneath. That would really bug me. <laughs> Just so you know. Mizubi. I'm really sad. I have no idea what, like I have those like the store content trunks installed for like kids. And they're like they don't show up in my game anymore. They used to. Now they don't, and it makes me really sad. <laughs> Oh goodness. Um dun, 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 dun. Ooh, I like that like spice berry color on the side. I don't like the kind of shoe. I've never liked those kinds of shoes. Like they were really popular one year when I was in school. Or actually, well, maybe a couple years when I was in school. Could not stand them. I was so tired of seeing them on literally everybody's feet. <laughs> dag dag! Sperries, is that what they were called? Mm-mm. -mm. Could not get behind them at all. It's like new. No. But then I also don't like Uggs. I think Uggs are like this. In this way. And this is just my opinion. But I think Uggs are really ugly. <laughs> like they're these just these like really chunky boots. And I had someone that like handed down a pair to me, or actually like two pairs. I tried wearing them once and they made my feet so sweaty. Like they were like little saunas for your feet. I was like, nope. And I'm just, we're just gonna pass on that. I'm, all, I'm okay, thanks. I ended up passing them off to somebody else. When I was younger, like it was one of those things that like my mom and like her group of friends, like, like she had a, f a friend that had a daughter that was like 
a couple years older than me, and she'd hand down her clothes to me. And then my mom had another friend that was, like, her daughter was a couple years younger than me. And so, like, after it didn't fit me anymore, I'd pass them off to her. And then there was another friend with a daughter that was, like, another year younger. And, like, like the clothes just kept getting passed along. Yeah, so uh, the, the Uggs were pretty fast to get, pretty quick to get uh, booted along. So, I'm good. Maybe I'll just give them flip-flops. It is in the middle of winter, so like his outfit is not like the most, like the, the friendliest for the weather that is outside right now, but I mean, Caspian is probably one of those kids that like, he does, he's, he is one of those boys that goes to school when it's like negative four <laughs> degrees out in shorts. In short, like, that's my brother. My brother would wear, like, was one of those kids. And, like, I had, I grew up with boys that would just, like, wore shorts all year long. Like, that were in my grade. Like, you are fools. <laughs> you are idiots. <laughs> Anyways. If that is you, I'm not trying to offend you. I apologize. But, like, we'd be waiting in the drop-off line. And, like, we would count the amount of boys that would walk in to school in the morning in shorts. Like, when it was, like, freezing out. So, anyways, I'm gonna end this part here. In the next video, we're gonna have a feast party. Um, and we're going to... I'm hoping he shows up in the list of people to invite. Um, but, yeah, we're gonna see if we can get a bunch of free food. Not that we know a whole lot of people, because, like, Finn has kind of fallen out with most of the people that, like, he used to be friends with. So, and like, everybody else doesn't live here, so yeah. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I have my gaming channel and my Twitter both linked down in the description below. If you'd like to check either of those things out, I would greatly appreciate it. And yeah, thank you guys, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.